Uh, what do you think about what uh, Darren's saying, man, with that a One Nation remaster ever come out? Well, see, the, the One Nation album, it was, Pac did like 16, 17 tracks, and this was around June of 96. So it was after All Eyes and Me sessions, before mm -hmm. the Machiavelli sessions, right? Mm -hmm. And he did like 16, 17 tracks with Boot Can't Click. That's where that Thug Love with uh, Bone Thugs and Harmony is from. That's where that Smile with Scarface is from. So he was going to have an album with Boot Camp Click, Scarface, Spice One, Cocaine. Um, and he also wanted a Roots and Outcasts on there as well. But he mm. never got the chance to record those actual songs with those other artists. So it's rumored that we would have seen a, a second round recording in September or October of 96, but we never got that. And now it's going to be released on his uh, sub-label, Machiavelli Records, which never got off the ground because he passed away. Now, a lot of the songs, like Military Minds and stuff, ended up on Better Days. The Less Fight song got remixed with um, 50 Cent called Realist Killers. And, you know, Tupac had the hook on there and they, you know, totally removed that for 50 Cent. But there's other tracks that are still unreleased probably like a good five or six tracks and they can actually mm -hmm. put it out because all the songs that they did release of one nation, they actually remixed. So okay. they can put out the original versions with the original artists like Reg nice and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. So I, I think it'll be kind of cool to see because the songs are just found online. And now it, it's not really up to a par with the production of all eyes of me. It's more like a gritty East coast. Cause you do have the boot camp click in, heavily involved in that project. Mm -hmm. I just think it'll be a great, like, um, just really bringing in one of his last projects that he wanted to to life. And it's a shame that he never got to finish it because he actually wanted to record with all these artists, even Nas on that project as well.